Right, adventure seekers. What is it, August 19th, 20th, something like that. Riding Casper to the car show at Pioneer High School. Stay tuned. Good morning again, adventure seekers. Pioneer High School, August 20. Got ourselves another car show. Must be the weekend for the car show. The Ford F100 over there at Santa Maria Inn. We got the cruising cars here this morning as well. Check it out. These people put some love, money, and attention into these cars. Look at this gentleman shining her up. She's looking good. Looking good, my friend. Oh. Okay, from the Inquirer. Inquirer, National Inquirer. I'm going to put you on the map. Yeah, on the map. So what, um, this car's going to be on TV better. later today. Uh, oh, yeah. youth football, huh? Yeah. Oh, well. Yeah. Good little support. Gonna have to check this one out. The touch of style. That says it all with this one. That is a touch of style, my friend. That metal flake. Love it. Loving it. All right. Yeah. Love the paint job on this one. I love it. Sweet. Even the fire extinguisher has an awesome paint job. That's stylish. That's a Camino. Such a style. <laughs> the Cadillac. Low and mean. Yeah, this is an awesome color. Got to like this Malibu. It's cruising. 350. I bet you that'll get you there in a hurry, too. Look at that. Yeah, you don't see many of these at all. Yeah, I love that. It's a beautiful color, man. 1948 Fleet Line. That is the way. Like me. Take some love to keep that wood looking so good. Yeah. Yeah, those rims are awesome, man. These guys don't mess around with their vehicles. Beautiful. 1948. Another 48 Plymouth. We are cruising today. Pioneer High School has got the rides. Styling rides. Supporting youth football. Huh? Great. Chevy 1951. And before I was born. That's when they made cars for class. Yeah, the thing's different, all right. 1951. That's when they used to design cars with style and love. None of this plastic junk anymore. They made it real metal. They actually used metal. Deluxe. Another one. Oh, yeah. Ooh. Like those tires and rims. Nice color. Sweet. Liking it. Definitely have some fun cruising with this baby. Okay, adventure seekers. You want some adventure? Cruise around in this bad truck. Oh, yeah. Oh, it mean. Got the rifle for the shifter. Oh, got some trophies there. Yes, the car show. Best of show, even. Love that engine. Get ready. Ready to get you there in a hurry. Oh, yeah. Rat rod action. I love it. Love those rat rods. No two alike. 
Right, if you need to work on the other side of your car, this is the way to do it. Get plenty of room to change the oil. <laughs> nice, look at rims and tires, pinstriping. You'll probably hop on down the road. If you get a flat tire, who cares? You can still make it home in this one. Checking it out. Beautiful looking machines. Felix Chevrolet. Oh, that's beautiful paint job. Yeah, chromed the springs, chromed everything. Touch of style. I don't like it. I love these cars. These guys know how to shine them up. Keeping them clean and mean. GMC truck lowered, ready to go. Alright, Oldsmobile. Here come the Harleys. Rolling in. These guys are ready for action. Rolling on in with the Harley. Oh yeah. 73. Nice metal flake paint job. Rims and tires lowered. Nice. Oh, convertible Impala. that top. I got this interior. Set it up right. Original looking. I like the tape. Yeah. Cool. I like it. Like we got Cobra rolling in. Looking good, the King Cobra. Come on, let's go, King. Find a place to park that sweet looking machine. Love the sound of the King Cobra. Nice ride. Oh, the King sounds mean. <laughs> nice truck, bro. Lightning. Plymouth rolling in. Sweet dude. Roadrunner. Got the Beamer. Oh, here goes the chopper. Yeah. Nice. Harley boys are out. Ready to show off their ride. Speaking of motorcycles. Island convertible Chevy Impala. Check out the interior of this one. Original, but nice. Got the engine dialed in. All chromed out. 
Take some time cleaning that. Nice. 3100. Who's it? That's under your control. At Granger, we're VW action. Branch staff at over 250 locations, so you get the custom deluxe. Supporting that youth football. Or just stop by. You go, guys. Suit up for action. Looking for ways to shine this summer? With summer Tear up, boy. Tear up. Leather convertible. Cruise and low and mean with a convertible. Checking out this Chevy. Oh, these guys put some time and money into these. K5 Blazers. And rims and tires on this one. K5 Blazer. Riding high. Styling the Pismo with this one. Probably wouldn't want the sand on it though, that's for sure. The Packard. I like the looks of this one. Don't see too many of these running around. Got the sunshade. Even the hood ornament's classy. 1950. And the Master Deluxe. 1941. You'd be the master with this Deluxe ride. Yeah, beautiful thing. Oh man, Louis! Man, right look at these rides, dude! Gang, right here. That's right. You, see, that's what. This is show. This is show you. You should clean up your car more. Yeah. These guys are showing you up. That's good. These things are sweet. I'm gonna hire the little white guy. Yeah, I do it. Five dollars an hour. Yeah. <laughs> I work cheap. Okay, folks. 1938. Man, almost there. What is that like? 85 years old. See him like this. The Masters. The Deluxe Masters. Low and mean and Paula. Check out the paint job on the roof, even. Don't scratch my roof. It's awesome. That's right, man. Beautiful car. Another convertible Impala. Low and mean. Sweet. So looking interior. I spent some time and money on this one. Like it. Right, adventure seekers. You want to take your family to the drive in in style? This is the way to go. Low and me. Even got that TV antenna. It gets all the channels with that. Uh, the convertible. 1970. Like it. Another uh, Chevy. Oh man. I tell you. These rides are sweet. They got the matching paint jobs. Impala, look how low that is. Matching his and hers. Brother and sister car. If you gotta get a hot rod, you have to get one for the wife too. So I want my own. I said, you ain't gonna get one if I, unless I get one too. All right, Adventure Seekers, here you go. So it's probably got to be at least almost 100 years old, probably. Let's check it out. Not sure of the year. I suggest it's probably about 100 years old. Can be cruising on down the road in this thing. There you go. Look at that engine, man. At least that'll save you on gas. <laughs> About original as you can get, but it's still gonna get you there in style. What do you think? You ready for one of these cars? 
I bet you when you drive it, you're gonna be driving something cool. That's right. Oh, this is yours. Oh man, that's cool, man. Hey, you mind telling me how how'd you acquire this? Uh, I got it off an auction in Long Beach. Auction in Long Beach, huh? What what inspired you to get get this uh, thing? You just always liked them, or? No, I was you're... actually buying a, a truck for my dad. Uh huh. And I was on there waiting and place a bid, and all of a sudden this one came up, and it wasn't even registered yet. Uh huh. On the, on the website. Right. So it came in. I was like, oh, I have to bid on it. I yeah, I have to bid, bid on, on it. it. I just kept bidding. I was like, you know what? It. Just have to have it. it. That's right, man. It's, it's like once you see something, you feel the love. You just yeah. have to have it, and then, yeah, you put the time and attention into it. And it's I bet you get lots of attention when you're cruising down the road on this oh, thing. Yeah. The main thing we're bringing it out today. I, I spent the last couple of weeks just nonstop day and night trying to get it going. Uh huh. Well, thank you for bringing it out. <laughs> this thing's awesome. All right. Well, good luck with your uh, football. Hope you win. All right. Bel Air. All right, the Bel Air. This one's sweet. Red and white. Classic combination. That engine. Spend some time and money on this one. Oh, yeah. Oh, let's do a little close up of the interior. Ah, beautiful white. Don't you get in if you have mud on your shoes on this car, folks. It's too much time. Love money, so what into that? All right, looks like he's got the switches ready. This probably is a hopper. Definitely got some hydraulics on it. Check out the engine of this one. 327. Dialed in. Dialed in. Yeah. Come on out, adventure seekers. Pioneer High School, Santa Maria. Got the cars here. 1967 Chevy El Camino. Oh, we gotta get a close up. A close up of the rear of this one. Oh man, at least he carries spare batteries. It's never gonna be high and dry without a battery. <laughs> 65 Impala. Looking good. The Permita. Custom, man, custom everything on these super sport. Another nice ride. Don't know which one you choose if you had to choose. Yeah, nice to be a judge here, but I wouldn't know which one to give the love to because they all are lovely cars. I like it. I don't like these rides, folks. This is the way to cruise down the road. So messing around when you have a ride like this. Galaxy 500 convertible. Nice. Beautiful color combination on this truck. And oh yeah, you like that. A little hydraulic action. You want to ride high, you want to ride low. Oh, I bet you it will. I love these cars, my friend. So you built this You built this on your own? Kudos to you, man, kudos. I love these machines. My dad was an artist like this, and he just had just visioned it in his mind, and he could build it. He never do anything on paper, and he never had a drawing or anything. He would just see it in his mind. Next thing, I can chop, I can chop, I can hop, and I can come up with something that there's nobody else. I love these, but nobody else has them. Unique, and it's just, it's just, uh, it's just four you. Years, four years of building it, and now it's been showing for about five years now. Yeah. And uh, it's gonna be on TV in December on my classic car. Uh, they, uh, they put, they made the director's cut. Okay. And, uh, so it will be on TV. And it won so many, this thing wins so many awards, I don't want to show it anymore. It's just I mean, look at, look between the seats. Yeah, I saw that, I saw that trophy and I, the, yeah. that just goes to show you, that was in 2019, it won best of show out of all these guys. Uh huh. Um, and so, uh, yeah, I've, I've maxed it out. So now I'm uh -huh. building a 62 Old Cutlass, you know, just a you know, grandma car, you know, a little GM uh, small compact. Uh -huh. So I push this off to the side, cover it in the garage there, and I, 
now I'm working on it, you know, and, and building it into a, a retro mod. And it's, it's getting closer to start working on the interior and stuff, but it's uh, all the other characters, all modern, modern motor, everything in it. Uh -huh. um, but I like this, you know, being old school and everything. I've almost put this up for sale a couple times. You know, so oh, man, oh, really? Never, never be able to get oh, it. Oh, yeah. I mean, no once you put that much love into something, it's hard to part with. It becomes like a, <laughs> a baby to it. It is. It is. It's in my heart. And it, even the small cab, you know, you can't find these small cabs anymore. Oh, yeah? Last year for Chevy uh, was the 46. Ford did one more year as the 47, but Ford's were dime a dozen. You can find those anywhere. But Chevy's, you can't. Yeah. So this came out of a barn, fully fendered everything, all bone stock, never been cut. And it took me a while to find one. That was that, you know, nobody's cut it. So. And I got it from the guy in, up in San Francisco, paid him 900 bucks for it. Uh, oh, dude, it. really? Yeah, if you keep the engine, I don't want it. He's going to get a big block Chevy put in it. And uh, so I started, that's what, four years stripping it, rebuilding it. It's all original frame, everything's all still there. Yeah. Sold off the fenders and everything, and drill. And uh, the shotgun, my grandpa's shotgun. And, all this stuff just sitting there going, I can make this thing into a badass. But I, I built it so low that eventually I can make it into a hot rod. Yeah. I can go up with it. But if you can't go down once you build a hot rod, you put all paint, chrome, and all that stuff. Now, how are you going to turn it into one of these? You can't. Right. So I actually have a full blown rat rod. Yeah, that's what I tell people. I said anyone can buy something, but when you build something like this, that's that's a totally different class of uh, custom car, if you ask me. Yeah. So good job. Appreciate it. I can see why this is an award winner. <laughs> it's even ready for Halloween. Check out that ornament. Oh yeah. Hey, another rat rolling in! Another rat rolling in! No rat! <laughs> Mr. Rat Rod! Plymouth! Looking good, man. A lot of love and time went into this thing, didn't it? Oh, dude. Oh, you left your partner in the back so long. He's, he's, he's not, nothing but skin and bone. No, just bone. He ain't even got no skin no more. What do you think, youngster? Do you feel special in this ride? I bet you feel special when you're cruising this thing. Get a lot of love going down the street in this, don't you? Not many people have something this cool. All right. Good job, my friend. Look at this. Atlas Custom Sound. Let's check out the woofers in the back of this thing. Some woofers. You run out of gas, you just turn the stereo on loud and get on down the road. Voila, from the rear. All right, they're still rolling in. The green machine. Looking good, my friend, looking good. That's a sweet Impala. Love that color.
bringing out their nice ride. Sweet. Hardly time. These guys roll in as an experience. Just of the custom Harleys here. Hi, Karumba. You know when these guys show up. Some beautiful rides, gentlemen. What? Ladies and gentlemen, the Harleys have a ride, bro. And you guys, when you arrive, you know it. That's right. These things are awesome. Ain't no denying. When you have to ride in style, this is the way to do it. They're on some custom Harley Davidson motorcycles. 114 cubic inches. California cruising on these things. Ladies and gentlemen, the Harleys have arrived. I like the sweet looking machines. These things will get you there in a hurry. People will know you have arrived when you come to one of these. Oh yeah, the Guadalupe. Oh yeah. Sweet looking exhaust on this one. Right, looks like we're supporting some youth football here. These guys ready for action. Want to play some football, guys? Football. Oh, yeah. A little football time. Look, he's crawling over this thing. There must be free donuts in that truck or something. They're all over it. Have no problem changing the oil in this blazer. I think I could walk under that thing. I'm that dude. This is one awesome looking ride. Oh, I don't know if it's more beautiful underneath or from the sides. I'm too short to even get the interior. <laughs> Put a lot of love, time, and money into this, didn't you, sir? Yeah. But it was worth it. That thing is a showstopper. You ever take it out to the dunes just to show off? Cruise up and down the beach just to show us what you got. Yeah, yeah, might as well. Yeah, just go. The problem is, just got to make sure you clean it up real good when you get home. That stinking salt water and sand will tear them up. But other than that. This thing will do it in style. Well, good job, my friend. Love it. Rolling in. 37 vessel. All right, adventure seekers. We have the whole custom team. They're out, ready for portrait time. Harley riders. Harley riders. All right guys, portrait time. Get on out there. We've seen your rides. 
Official photographer here. Looking good, gentlemen. Oh, yeah. All right, Mark. I have to get a look at this one. That's a beautiful paint job. The Screaming Eagle Edition. Nice. Oh, yeah. Love those rims. Easy boy. All right, adventure seekers, no matter what you're driving, you gotta drive it with style. Looking good, keeping the place clean for us. 805 Central Coast, cleaning her up. Looking good, looking good. Spit shine that ride. Kinds of different car clubs represented here today, Adventure Seekers. Yeah. Nice pinstriping, nice interior. Chevy, Brookwood. Good looking, right. Let's see those around too often, folks. The DeSoto. Even. Classy hood ornament. Ooh. Yes. Nice. Way to do it, folks. Get yourself a classic ride. Cruise the Boulevard. USO Car Club. 1951. USO Edition. Bel Air. She is a beauty. A beauty. Close up of this interior, this one. Nice. All right. There's the engine. Oh, right. Puppies. Bring in the pups. Brother and sister. Brother and sister. Showing each other a little love. They're even happy about these rides. Say, which one are you going to pick, Dad? Which one are you going to cruise me around in? Hey, 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 yeah, you're a good one. Yeah, you smell my puppy, don't you? Yeah, you smell my puppy, don't you? Yes, you're happy. You're happy anytime you get to come out. Yes, you're a happy puppy. Yes, you are. I'm glad you're a happy puppy, because if you weren't happy, I'd be bummed. <laughs> Part of it, your seekers. Show a little ad here. Sunday, September 25th. Ventura County Fairgrounds. We have another car show coming up. Going down. Check it out. All right, Adventure Seekers. Another quick look at the Harley collection here. They're rolling on out. You gotta love that sound, bro. You gotta love it. Oh, I got the street racers even. What do you think, puppy? Do you like your truck? Oh, you are a beautiful puppy. Oh, you are a cute one. That's so cute. Come here. Come on, puppy. 
Come on. Came at the wrong time. Show me that cute face. Yes, there, there you go. There you go. You are just so cute. Everybody must love you. I think you're even smiling. I think you're even smiling. Yes, you are. El Lobo. King of the hill. El Lobo.